Okay, this is the last New Year's Six Bowl. The only New Year's Six Bowl game I forgot to talk about, and I apologize. Because I should have talked about all of them at one time, like I said I would. But you got the Peach Bowl in Atlanta, Georgia. You got uh, Michigan State taking on Pittsburgh in the Peach Bowl. This should be a really, really good game, you know. A really bad defense like Michigan State, but Michigan State's offense is very good. Their running game with Kenneth Walker, very good, uh, good, very good on at running the football. On the other half, you have uh, Pittsburgh Panthers. You got a really good quarterback with um, Kenny Pickett, really good at throwing the football. Can obviously run. You can ask Wake Forest about that one. <laughs> um, this should be a really good football game. And Pittsburgh's defense is no slouch. They shut down Wake Forest. After the first quarter, so that's nothing. That's no easy task. Mm. This game should be easy, but it shouldn't be because this is a Peach Bowl. Michigan State's had a, a really, really good foot, a really good year this football season. They've won ten games. Uh, they're going to a New Year's Six Bowl, first time in a Big Bowl since the playoff game with Alabama in the Cotton Bowl play, college football playoff semifinal, where they got destroyed. Michigan State's headed in that direction again. I think next year they'll either be an, uh, another New Year's Six Bowl or a playoff team version for Michigan State. They're going to get better next year. Um, I'm really impressed with um, the head coach. With um, I can't remember his name. I know he made not nine. I know I don't know the coach for Pittsburgh either. So whatever. I've just watched both teams play. Mel Tucker, Michigan State. Sorry guys. No 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 disrespect, Michigan State Spartans. Um, I'm really impressed with what he's done with Michigan State. Even last year, they won some games they shouldn't have won. It's carried over into this season. It's going to carry on to the next season. He's making $95 million. Congrats to him. He deserves it. He's the real deal as far as the head coach goes. But uh, uh, offensively, I think they can play with Pittsburgh as far as putting up points. Defensively, that's the, that, that's the concern. Pittsburgh is really good at throwing the football. Kenny Pickett's a very good uh, passing quarterback, and he can run. While I think Michigan State's run defense can hang with Pittsburgh's running game, I don't think I know they can't slow down Kenny Pickett. I know he's no C.J. Stroud, but he's still pretty darn good. He's still worth a million dollars at least. So, mm. and Pittsburgh's defense I think can hang with Michigan State long enough to get some stops and maybe a key turnover. I know I'm picking my nose. I don't care. You're gonna watch this anyway. Uh, I gotta go with Pittsburgh in this game. This won't be a blowout by any means. Michigan State's better than Wake Forest, but again, their defense is vulnerable to the pass. I think it's the worst pass defense, if not one of the worst pass def defenses in the country this year. So, unless they have turnovers, I got Pittsburgh winning the Peach Bowl. 45-41, something like that. No, 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 